Jack it up.
Just the sort of weather the fans were hoping for this evening. It's absolutely ideal. I'm Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry, and alongside me at the microphone is Stuart Robson. I'm greatly looking forward to bringing you live coverage of this match being played in Serie A. Stuart, what are you expecting? Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff. Rebic! It's still alive! The first of the derby goes to the Rossoneri. A real jolt to the home fans. So the match has restarted. 1 0 here. And Milan looking dangerous. Rade Krunic. On the ball, Rafael Leao. Teammate available. Oh, a moment of pure class. Had to catch it perfectly. And didn't he just? Well, a second goal for them here. Promising sequence. And this situation could be dangerous. Oh, a perfectly timed pass. Muriel. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. That is tackling of the highest order. Is it going to end up being productive for them? Rafael Leao. Ante Rebic has it. Remo Freuler outdoing his opponent. And possibilities here. It's with Jaron. Good technique displayed. And a tidy challenge. Brahim. On the ball, Rafael Leao. Well, as the stats confirm, Milan have controlled the ball and they've made good use of it. They really have Oh, sure, it's a chance. And not the best clearance. And a decent idea, but a difficult pass to execute. Rebic pulls it back. And they Three goals in front now, an immense performance. So the live action continues, it's all Milan, they hold the aces. A very good tackle. Poor pass. not quite accurate enough and the throw in then well that shouldn't really happen from a throw in
They might be able to get in now. In with a chance. Losing possession. Remo Freuler. And just couldn't keep the ball. Davide Calabria. And space to exploit, maybe. Options in the centre. And there it is, the half-time whistle. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Martin Deron. Luis Muriel has it. And effectively parried away by the keeper. Now can they counter clinically? Defenders need to cover. And a good-looking ball. What a lovely strike! Lethal piece of finishing. Drilled home with true conviction. Tremendous goal. So they restart the game and only one team in it. possession oh a perfectly timed pass Muriel opportunity here that's high level goalkeeping well that's a fantastic save he's such a good keeper short corner taken textbook defending inside the box and into the last 30 minutes now. I'm not sure why the fans are so upset. I think the referee got that absolutely right. It's a good-looking ball in behind. Well, not on the target. The keeper seemed to have it covered. Well, he did seem to have it covered, but it's not a bad effort, though. He really did strike it well. Brahim. Excellent vision. And reading it absolutely superbly. And Milan have the ball once more. Zlatan Ibrahimovic. Kea has it. 20 minutes to go in this one. Brahim. Given away by Milan. Good work from the Rossoneri to win the ball back. Alexis Salamakers. Rade Krunic. Rafael Leao. Federico Matiello, Duvan Zapata, Muriel, but nothing comes of it, good defending it was. Brahim, Not showing good defensive judgment. Diaz, well he's thwarted him almost effortlessly. Getting in there to intercept. Rafael Leao. And the keeper's in trouble. Well, well, well. How many players would have the confidence to try that? Simply magnificent. Oh my goodness, it's so one-sided. 5-0 in this match. And a stoppage time situation. One minute here. A sloppy pass. 
So there it is, the final whistle, and it's... When you want to get off that darkest ground The gravity pulls you straight down Earth from a bird's eye view You should grow feathers and see this too
And so the match is underway. And introducing the visitors' lineup today, Pepe Reina is the goalkeeper. Sergei Milinkovic Savic plays alongside Luis Alberto in central midfield. And so many different ways to configure an attack. In this case, it'll be two men up front. Well, I'm not sure about you, Stuart, but I always think there's something very elegant about a naturally left footed player who attacks. Josip Ilicic, one such player. What might we see from him today? Well, Derek, he's the perfect finisher. He's got a great shot in him. His movement is excellent. And in 1v1 situations, you always expect him to score. Well, the keeper had to intervene under a bit of pressure there. Martin Deron. Ilicic. Malinowski. Can he put them in front? Oh, no! opportunity and they remain level well he just lacked composure there didn't he they should be ahead now Immobile Ilicic well that's one for them to pursue not really the ideal clearance well, if you make your move too early, you're always in danger of being ruled offside. Ciro Immobile. Cataldi. Milinkovic Savic. And can they prize them open now? Here's Milinkovic Savic. And back with Milinkovic Savic. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. In behind for him to chase. Just couldn't capitalise there. Can they get themselves in front here? Routine, really. Excellent ball over the top. And that'll be the goalkeeper's ball. Remo Freuler. This attack looks highly promising. Muriel. Superb block on the back of the ball. It could be up for grabs. Oh, a stellar piece of defending. Well, you sense it's just a matter of time before they do score, Derek. They've been piling on the pressure now and really should be ahead in this one. Now, let's see what they can do here. Great opportunity. Absolutely spot on with that challenge. And out of play, the pass nearly worked out, but not quite. Cataldi and the ball with Milinkovic Savic Immobile can they forge ahead well they would have done had it not been for the keeper well they should be ahead now yes it was a good save Derek but he should well the keeper is happy the bar was there and he's lost custody of the ball here chance maybe Danger averted for now. The first half here comes to an end. And so the second half gets underway. Almost a case of the two teams saying to each other, whatever you can do, I can do just as well. Davide Zapacosta. Another perfect position to read it. Good technique displayed. Well, diving magnificently to make sure he got there. 
Well, just listen to these fans. They're urging their team to score here and take the lead. It might still be problematic. But it looked so threatening, but the danger averted. Well, probably a fair assessment of his first half's work would be a mixed bag. Well, he struggled to have any real impact on the game. I think if they are to kick on in the second half, it's key that he sees a bit more of the ball. And hopefully with that, he can start to put that back line under a bit more pressure. He'll try his luck here. And he's kept it out, fully stretched, somehow reaching it. Who's going to get on the end of it? Well, not great on the accuracy front. Goal kick here. Really good reading of the game to win possession back. Can he finish? Oh, body in the way, crucially. Useful looking ball. But in fact, he's taken up an offside position. Oh, that's frustrating. He just took too long to see the pass. Crossing opportunity. Not the best clearance. Oh, a good diving save. Playing it short. Raymond Freuler giving it a try. And denied by the post. Oh, he squandered the opportunity. He might be relieved, though, to see that the offside flag is up. Well, the linesman's sparing his blushes here, but you have to say, it was a shocking effort. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. Really vital interception here. And he read it well defensively. Just 20 minutes remaining now. Luis Alberto. Felipe Anderson. Nicely timed tackle. Now the keeper completely untroubled. Malinowski. Remo Freuler. Well, nicely cut out. Now, what can they do with the ball? Well, they're eyeing that final pass, you just feel. But it was a good-looking sequence, but it comes to an end. And the search goes on for a winner. Time is tight. Struggling to keep the ball. Pedro, and he's in. Can you believe it? With so little time left, surely that will be the winner. Amazing scenes here. Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. Well, on the attack, hunting for a late equaliser here. Effective challenge. Not a great pass. This might have potential. So a deflection, and they can get ready for the corner kick routine. Not away completely. Well, they can bring it out now. Two minutes of stoppage time coming up. Good defending. Opportunity here, Anderson! And the keeper getting across to stop it. Well, they'll be looking to add to their advantage from this corner. And that is the end of the game. It goes into the history.
here on the commentary position and alongside me is the former Arsenal West Ham and commentary midfielder Stuart Robson and the focus is very much on Serie A the top division here in Italy Stuart what are you expecting to see well thanks Derek as always the scene is set two good teams a great playing surface and a vibrant atmosphere it has all the ingredients for a really exciting game top class defending Immobile. And that's fantastic goalkeeping to get across and deal with the danger. Can someone get on the end of this? This is the Milan starting 11. Mike Mignon begins in goal. Teo Hernandez starts with Davide Calabria in the fullback positions. And the story in attack is one of a strike partnership. Oh, Derek, what a moment this could be. There it is. And just the ideal start. The ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? Zlatan Ibrahimovic. Plenty of forward momentum here, but can they produce? Well, that's how to put in a clean tackle. Felipe Anderson. Now they've lost it. Rade Krunic. And he's taken it away. And there's vision for you from Slatan Ibrahimovic. And missing the chance to give them a bit of breathing space. Well, that should have made it more comfortable, shouldn't it? But it's a wasted opportunity. Oh. 
take it away. Well, he's lost the ball. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Milinkovic Savic. Brahim. Given away by the Rossoneri. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. And dispossessed. Luis Alberto. Oh, great play. But was able to do his job defensively in the end. Rafael Leao. Well, it's a poor tackle. Targets available, cross comes in. And he's done well to tip it over the bar. Well, but also Neri pushing to add to the lead. It'll be a corner. Attending to his defensive chores. Milinkovic Savic. Cataldi, Immobile now. Felipe Anderson. Now Immobile. And a goal, the equaliser. Superb entertainment. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Luis Alberto. Can they create something from here? Oh, lovely weighted ball. They might be in. And denied by the keeper. Impressive. Let's see about the delivery. And danger still. Well, they can keep possession now. Well, you have to think they're going to take the lead at some point because they're really looking dangerous at the moment. Well, a lot to like about Ciro Immobile and his first-half performance. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, that's exactly what his team needed because they weren't at their best in the first half. And once again, it shows what a key player he is. Can they build on that in the second 45? Radek Krunic. Rebic. Really good challenge. Oh, great vision. Immobile. Thirty minutes left for play. Tackling and winning the ball to boot. Pedro. Now Immobile, he scored once already and close to making it a double. Well, every time he gets on the ball, he looks a real danger today. Just far too close to the goalkeeper. Well, the stats tell you everything. They've played well, they've created chances, and I think they've been the better team. They now have to convert one of those opportunities. It's there for him! Cataldi, can they hit on the break? And he's through here. Well, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending.
outdoing his opponents. Sandemakers. And a goal to re-establish their advantage. Just look at the celebrations. Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. But they look as though they want to make this move count. Oh, he's left his marker for dead. Well, he has cause to be grateful to his teammates. Pedro. Well, it did look dangerous for a moment, but the keeper has it now. And a blunder by the keeper. Well, it's the late show, and they are level again. And level again here. This has been quite the roller coaster ride. Pedro, Felipe Anderson, and still on the lookout for the goal that could be so important at this juncture. Milinkovic Savic, here's Pedro, and a very good challenge. But it comes down to the final five minutes. Going about his defensive business with a minimum of fuss. Milinkovic Savic. Well, what a final few minutes we have here. And the fans are certainly playing their part. But can they take one of these chances that come their way and win this game? The referee has decided there will be just one minute of added time. Immobile. Luis Alberto. And that is it for the 90 minutes.
like these are just what you hope for as a spectator a warm welcome i'm derek ray on the commentary gantry and delighted to be joined as always by stuart robson and the focus is very much on Serie A, the top division here in italy stewards what are you expecting to see good looking move this he's got to score and there it is the opening goal of the derby goes to milan and that has silenced the majority in here Underway again with Milan in charge. Brahim. On the ball, Rafael Leao. Rebic. Great opportunity. Couldn't quite hang on. A chance for them to provide a test in the form of a corner. Routine, really. And the right place to cut out the pass. And Milan looking dangerous. In position. And they couldn't add to their advantage. Well, that would have put them in complete control. He should have scored there. Ilicic. Teammates in the middle. And he's got a score to level it again. So back underway. One goal apiece here. Rebic. And just couldn't keep the ball. It's a neat move. Must take the lead here. Not out of the woods yet. Marvellous anticipation. And the keeper hangs on at the second attempt. Well, he's done really well, hasn't he? Great stop and then the reaction. Federico Mattiello. And the ball back with Milan now. Rade Krunic. Superbly read and executed. Oh, that's an interesting pass. That's all they can conjure for now. Well, an opportunity here for them to get their noses in front from the corner. Not away completely. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Malinowski. Can he make it count? There it is! A fantastic goal, and no wonder he's off celebrating. So back underway, and here's the question can Milan articulate the right reply? This 
a nice looking ball well they couldn't make anything of that cross with the ball in a decent enough position an effective challenge losing possession here well as you can see the hosts have had much less of the ball but their counter-attacking has been really good particularly in the wide areas it's been an excellent performance from them so far poor pass under no real pressure Ibrahimovic there to win it back now the managers will now deliver their heart the two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half They keep working away, looking for passing lanes. Good work from Milan to make sure possession changed hands. Excellent vision. Ibrahimovic. Martin Deron. You certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Stuart. Well, Derek, he took his goal well and was a constant threat throughout that first half. I thought he showed a lot of skill to get out of tight situations and he had a real impact on the plate. Brahim. Rade Krunic. On the ball, Rafael Leao. A real defensive commitment there. Not what he was intending. Bad pass. Firing it towards goal. And the keeper showing tremendous command. Who's going to get on the end of it? The clearance wasn't decisive. Last man back and job done. Read it superbly to take back possession. Oh, that's a really good run. Oh, couldn't pull them level. Well, they certainly should be level. That was a great opportunity to score. Oh, maybe the equaliser. Oh, he wasn't ruthless enough in front of goal. Keeper has it now. Federico Matiello. Zlatan Ibrahimovic and the referee takes exception to the challenge free kick well, this could pose problems for the defenders well flinging himself at the ball Ilicic well it could be on for him here Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. Pressing high to win the ball. They might be able to get in now. And they've done it to square the game once again. Accelerating. So underway again. And it's a story of parity. Two goals apiece in this one. And Foxing the defender. Muriel putting his body on the line. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. Milan still on the attack and the game's waning moments still level. Well, what a final few minutes we have here. And the fans are certainly playing their part. But can they take one of these chances that come their way and win this game? Can he put them in front? And a goal! Late derby drama has made...
Milan take the lead? What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? They've got to be really mindful of the time situation, attacking though they might be. Determined block. Time is not on the side. This corner could help the prospects as they look for an equaliser. Oh, he looks threatening. Well, high and more than a bit helpful. Now we can say it's final and we can say...
see today, Stuart. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. Malinowski. And introducing the visitors lineup today. Pepe Reina is the goalkeeper. Sergei Milinkovic Savic plays alongside Luis Alberto in central midfield. And the story in attack is one of a strike partnership. We're making high pressing work for them here. Well, I'm not sure about you, Stuart, but I always think there's something very elegant about a naturally left-footed player who attacks. Josip Ilicic, one such player. What might we see from him today? Well, it's his ability with the ball at his feet that makes him such a good player. He can go past defenders with ease, he can play in tight areas, and he has that bit of trickery as well. I'm really looking forward to seeing him play today. Really good reading of the game to win possession back. Milinkovic Savic. And take it away. Cataldi. Excellent defending. And he's broken free. Surely. Keeper had work to do. Felipe Anderson. The ball with Luis Alberto. Well, they've won possession back. What can they do from here? Martin Deron. Now, what can they do from here? Good play it in. Well, no pressure on the keeper. Poor cross. Good pressure. Can they make something of this? A oh, terrific pass. Struggling to get it away. Well, nothing comes of it. Not much time to make up his mind. Milinkovic Savic. Marusic. Well, pass after pass, maybe they can chisel an opportunity. Immobile finishing perfectly. Well, as a defender, you can do as much homework as you like. Sometimes you just can't stop your man. And back on the way. Ilicic! And he's missed it. Good heavens. Well, that's a big miss. That should have been the equaliser. Milinkovic Savic. Luis Alberto. Danilo Cataldi with it. Felipe Anderson. Top class defending. Well, getting close to the half time interval and the story so far, they're not really making home advantage count. Stuart, your take. Well, they've not had quite enough purpose to their attacking play so far. It's all been a bit too predictable. But in the second half, if they can get more support to their strikers and play with greater intensity, they can certainly turn this around. Chance here. Well, negligent in front of goal. No two ways about that. Martin Deron. He's given it away. And with that, the first half draws to a close. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Malinowski intercepting it intelligently. Luis Alberto. Well, one man who was very hard to contain in the first half was Chiro Immobile. And Stuart, I wonder what you made of him. 
Well, Derek, he took his goal well and was a constant threat throughout that first half. I thought he showed a lot of skill to get out of tight situations and he had a real impact on the plate. Well, they want that equaliser, but the passing remains smooth. Well, an easy one to cut out, really. Now can they counter clinically? Retaining possession proving difficult. Milinkovic Savic. And taking it away. Immobile. And he read it well defensively. Oh, left his man behind here. Oh, lovely incisive pass. And that is how to tackle inside your own penalty area. And attempting the through ball. Well, a piece of quick thinking by the keeper. Well, that's great goalkeeping. He read it so well, didn't he? Felipe Anderson. That is how to put in a challenge. He's been a bit unlucky to concede the corner. Well, they're going for the short one. And in by Pedro. Not away completely. Well, they can bring it out now. Can't miss, surely! Well, when all was said and done, he's failed to hit the target. Luis Alberto and it's a quality pass and a goal it was served up on a silver platter for him so 2-0 now he's managed to lose his marker clean challenge Well, nicely cut out. Now, what can they do with the ball? And now, passing it through. Oh, there it is! A lifeline in this game. And what a finale we could be in for here. So the ball is rolling again. 2-1 the scoreline. Useful looking position, you've got to say. Cataldi, the ball with Luis Alberto, opportunity here, Anderson, and a goal! He's doubled his total for the day, in superb scoring form! So back underway, 3-1 the score. Wants to attack from the wide areas. Options in the middle. Can he finish? Oh, magnificent reaction. Corner kick played in. Well, it has come to nothing. Able to get a body in the way. And so the referee blows for full time and it...
today, Stuart. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I've played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. Moving forward effectively. Milinkovic Savic. Immobile. Luis Alberto, now with Pedro, no way through, and Milan's lineup looks like this, Mike Mignon begins in goal, Davide Calabria plays with Teo Hernandez in the wide defensive areas, and the story in attack is one of a strike partnership. Pedro. Luis Alberto, what a crucial intervention inside the box. Can he find the net? And a fantastic diving save. And over it comes. It might still be problematic. And it's with Pedro. Failure to hold it there on Pedro's part. 
This is how the visitors will set up today. Pepe Reina is the goalkeeper. Sergei Milinkovic-Savic plays alongside Luis Alberto in central midfield. And it's two strikers up front. Derek, he's got to tuck this away. And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. And there's the delivery. Chance to put them in front. Absolutely spot on with that challenge. And just making the run a bit too early. Offside as a result. Can he make it count? And a goalkeeper in great form. And he's just pulled off an absolutely stunning save there. That is brilliant. Teo Hernandez. Making sure it didn't get past him. Fantastic work to thwart the danger. Milinkovic Savic. Careless in possession. Well, Milan have had most of the ball in the last 15 minutes and created a hat full of chances. But when you're enjoying that amount of possession, you need to make it count. Milinkovic Savic. Luis Felipe. Intelligent threaded pass here. And unable to keep possession. And that pass could be troublesome. He just needs to stay level-headed now. And read the danger magnificently. Well, if he gets this wrong, a penalty and a sending off. But he was spot on with his challenge. Milinkovic Savic. Working away patiently, looking for an opening. I think I spoke too soon. Wasn't the best of passes, finally. Can't miss, surely! And a goal! 1-0 it is! They've been pushing for the opener, and now they have it! So the ball rolling again, with the score line standing at 1-0. It's a promising Milan move. And a decent delivery. And a goal! A quick one too! And they've turned this game on its head! So 2-0 now. That's how to rob them of possession. Oh, splendid skill. Maybe. Not at all problematic for the goalkeeper. A chance then for the respect. The two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half. Well, no stopping him. And it's with Pedro. Here's Milinkovic, Savic. A chance to eat into their lead. What a vital intervention. Good tackle. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. He read the situation defensively and did his job. How well, far from the ideal pass, you've got to say. Retaining possession proving difficult. And they need to get tighter. Immobile. Wonderful chance. Fine goalkeeping to push that away. Applying vigorous pressure. Pedro. Could pull one back here. He can't hold on to it. And there the move will end because it's offside. Close, though. Zlatan Ibrahimovic. Brahim Diaz now. Oh, superb skill. Now defending always has to be a team effort. Good piece of covering. Cataldi. Milinkovic-Savic. 
The ball with Luis Alberto. Danilo Cataldi with it. And it's with Pedro. A spot on with that challenge. Pedro. Now Immobile. Well, the attack carried promise, but petered out. Into the final 20 minutes. So a throw in here. Salamakers. Zlatan Ibrahimovic. Well, he's thwarted him almost effortlessly. Cataldi. Pedro might well fancy this one. So back underway, intriguing contest this, given the 2-1 scoreline. This could square the game. Oh, but no! Heroism flashed in front of his eyes. Couldn't take the chance. Well, I think that's a poor miss. They really should be level now. Will they come to regret that? A oh, terrific pass. A matter of keeping his composure. Oh, a smart save. And that keeps them in with a chance. Well, there's still a bit of time left. Can this inspire them to go and get the... And just the header that was required. The goal they were in search of. So they get the ball moving again. He won the score. A real opening now. And a goal! If there were any remaining doubts, that will settle the issue. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. And he's going to be disappointed with that pass. And it's with Pedro. Well, a classic example of how to intercept. And that will be all for this game. Defeat for the... When you want to get off the darkest ground The gravity pulls you straight down Earth from a bird's eye view You should grow feathers and see this too
Welcome from a stadium that really does catch the eye, the Metropolitano here in Madrid. 
I'm Derek Ray, and my commentary partner here on the gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham player, Stuart Robson. And we're focusing on, technically speaking, one of the best leagues in the world. I'm talking, of course, about La Liga. It's Atletico Madrid, and they take on Sevilla. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. Suarez. Spot on with that tackle. Plenty of forward momentum here, but can they produce? My goodness, that save. Fully stretched he was. One for his own highlights reel. Who can he pick out? Well, the goalkeeper got there in the end. Well, his recovery is brilliant here. So athletic. Carrasco. in the centre Joao Felix here's Fernando it did look on for them but not to be Felix Llorente Joao Felix and Yannick Carrasco at the ready oh but claimed by the goalkeeper attending to his defensive chores and it's a quality pass and he's through really sound goalkeeping well that had to be a goal didn't it what a stop that is who can they pick out and the keeper put to the test but he comes through it well he's so sharp isn't he Great first save, and then the recovery. And given away by Atletico. Lovely work to get past his man. Could be troublesome. Lucas Ocampos. Now oh, the pass not finding its target. This looks threatening. Oh, blocked it! Looking for that final pass, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Well, visionary passing. Now, will they do it from here? Big chance it is. And there it is, 1-0. The efforts have been rewarded. And look at the celebrations. So, underway again here. 1-0 the score. Terrific pass. Oh, but cutting it out in the nick of time. Luis Suarez. Llorente. A good and fair challenge. They might be able to get in now. And he's in the clear. Strong hand on that one. Luis Suarez and he did well to cut it out Fernando possession changes hands the interception there Koke the first half here comes to an end And so the second half underway, Atletico with the lead, but who knows, there might still be a few twists and turns in this game. Johan Jordan, well, possibilities inside the box. Will he find the net? Oh, he's missed, but by a minuscule margin. Well, he couldn't have made better contact than that. His technique is brilliant. He's so unlucky there. Well, great read there to intercept. Gomez. 
Gomez looking for that final pass and for that chance to level the game well they get themselves level here tenacious tackling excellent defending there it might be perfectly set up for the counter attack you know and it was an eye-catching first half performance by Joao Felix sum it up for us well it was certainly a good first 45 minutes for the lad obviously he got his goal to put them in front but he's looked lively throughout too hopefully we see more of him wonderful chance keeper getting the touch and they can't quite take advantage in the end Marcos Acuna Papu Gomez this could level it oh but the keeper with an important save how important is that well he should score from there that's a wasted opportunity he should beat the keeper from that sort of distance perfect challenge well, up a cul-de-sac in terms of the attack and as you can see from the stats they've absolutely dominated the game they've been good in possession they've created chances but they just haven't been clinical enough in front of goal and that's the big problem oh could be and he's gone and scored to level it again so underway again following the goal that made things level Kunde Gomez in a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here they've only gone and grabbed another one two goals in quick succession now they have the lead no wonder they're celebrating what a big moment in the dying embers will it prove decisive here played into the box he's gone Goal. No shortage of goals in this match. 3 1. Well, this could pose problems for the defenders. Defended well. Now, counter attacking possibilities here. Can they take advantage of the situation? And they'll regard that as a very disappointing end to the move. Can he get one back? He can! And who's to say there's not enough time for them to level matters? It would be quite the story. Well, back underway. And a glut of goals here. 3-2. Atletico Madrid know they're not going to get too many more chances. Time is a factor. Marcos Acuna. Poor attempt at a pass, really. Decent position for Atletico to find themselves in. And return to Suarez. And breaking at pace with Menace. Well, in terms of added time, a minimum of one minute. Well, these Atletico players... And that is that. The referee blows his whistle for full...
and welcome from a stadium that really does catch the eye, the Metropolitano here in Madrid. I'm Derek Ray at the microphone and joining me for match commentary is Stuart Robson. And the focus is on one of the finest leagues in world football, La Liga. It's Atletico Madrid versus Villarreal. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, pinning the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining position. And that goes down as a very disappointing attempt. Well, the keeper can't believe his luck. That's a really poor effort. And here are the starters for Atletico. Jan Oblak stands between the posts. Renan Lodi plays with Kieran Trippier as fullbacks. Rodrigo Javier de Pau starts alongside Koke in central midfield. And so many different ways to configure. Oh, Derek, big moment here. Flinging himself at it, the keeper. Who's going to get on the end of it? Oh, terrific save from the keeper. Well, that's just a wonderful save. How did he stop that? And Koke with the delivery. And a bit short with the clearance. Now potential danger. Well, it looked like a decent avenue of attack, but he couldn't keep himself onside. Well, he's just a bit too eager there. All well and good playing on the shoulder, but he just needs to bend his run to stay on. Can they forge ahead? Well, no stopping him. Oh, good-looking run. Suarez. Referees are rightly praised for giving advantage, but when there is no advantage, it has to be a free kick. And he gets away with a warning here. In my view, that's good refereeing. Strong, but not officious. the free kick fired too close to the goalkeeper Etienne Capou and here's Gerard Moreno a delicious piece of skill now can they make something happen well a top-notch piece of defensive judgment Alcacer tackling and winning the ball to boot. Beautifully disguised ball and Koke in a fruitful position. And that was courageous whatever way you look at it, Stuart. Well, he had to time that right. What a good piece of goalkeeping that is. Moreno. Free kick awarded then by the referee. Well, some referees might have elected to hand out the yellow card, but no booking on this occasion. Moreno. They've won back possession. Renan Lodi. Now De Paul. Superb effort to keep it in. Throw-ins given. Etienne Capou. Alcacer. Good vision. Can he get onto this? Oh, a stellar piece of defending. Good movement, but nothing comes of it. Beautifully weighted ball. Less than convincing defense. In it goes! The goal for 1 0, and that changes the dynamic. So on they go again. Let's find out if Atletico can square the match. Moreno. Ball is loose. Oh, that's a pass of high quality. And the cross smuggled away. Well, these fans have had to be patient. Could this be the equaliser? And he takes on the shot. And using his body to good effect. And so it is, the first half story.
So on they go, the second half underway, and Atletico with a bit of work to do. This could be the equaliser, and it is the equaliser! Well now, that could be a huge turning point in this game. They carry the momentum. Back underway, level pegging, one goal apiece in this game. Carrasco. Patient build-up. He's in with a chance. Not to be for him. He went for power over placement. Well, you're right. He decided to go for the power, which in the end he couldn't control. He'll be furious with himself. That's a big miss. Ran it superbly to take back possession. How can they create something? Such an important goalkeeping intervention under pressure. Oh, he's given the ball away unnecessarily. Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Chance to take the lead. And still danger here. Really sound goalkeeping. Well, that had to be a goal, didn't it? What a stop that is. Not fantastic defending. Let's see if it helps the opposition. Now oh, doesn't get away with it. Free kick given. Alcantara. Well, they've lost possession of the ball. Committed challenge. Moving it forward. Now he must favour the cross. Well, no pressure on the keeper. Poor cross. Carrasco. Carrasco. Oh, the threat is there. Can they forge ahead? Well, they would have done had it not been for the keeper. Well, they should be ahead now. Yes, it was a good save, Derek, but he should score from there. And threading it forward. Well, it looked like a good ball, but cut out in the end. The Atleti fans are certainly playing their part, but can the players respond and get this winner? And they continue to advance, and a lot of options here. He's lost it. And here they come now, Atletico looking for a late winner. Just cutting off the supply. That is tackling of the highest order. They might be able to get in now. Struggling to get it away. Well, threat over for now. High quality defending. Great challenge, he got nothing but ball. And the electronic board showing one additional minute. I just missed that little bit of attacking spark. Goalkeeper's ball. And there's the whistle, all even at the end of...
Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. Good looking sequence, but quick thinking defensively. The Sevilla starting 11. Yassine Bounou is the goalkeeper. Jesus Navas plays with Marcos Acuna in the wide defensive areas. Suso starts with Lucas Ocampos in the wide positions. And the tactical configuration has two players in attack from the very outset. A wonderful intervention. Disappointing pass. And scope for them to produce something exciting. But they dealt with the threat posed. Really nice ball. Now he's got to stay calm. And goalkeeping of the highest order from Sergio Asenjo. Now sending it in. And the keeper put to the test, but he comes through it. Well, he's so sharp, isn't he? Great first save and then the recovery. And they have possession again. Really good challenge. And they do like to press whenever they can. Jesus Navas. Lost possession. Now, let's see what they can do here. Going for the dink. Terrific block there. Well, he tried in vain to get himself back on side. Well, he needs to show greater awareness there and hold on to the ball a fraction longer. Ocampos. And I'd be a bit annoyed to have lost the ball. Etienne Capou. And space for the cross. And a throw in it's going to be. And bizarrely, that's offside. Well, that's really sloppy. That was a great opportunity to keep the ball high up the pitch and work an opening. They've given it away. Lopez. On to Ocampos. And now they have the ball back. Well, as the stats show us, this has been a really even game so far. There just hasn't been enough guile or invention in the top third of the field from either team, which needs to change at some point. Ocampos. Here. Well, it could be on for him here. Well, he stormed through, but it didn't end well for him. Well, in those situations, you have to make a few decisions. Unfortunately, he's made the wrong one. Alcatar. Oh, getting the ball forward. But ultimately up a cul-de-sac. Lucas Ocampos. Here's Marcos Acuna. Kunde. Fernando. Ronnie Lopez. Well, he strayed offside just as it looked promising. That is that. As anticipated, plenty of talking points so far. And now the second half is underway. Ibora. Moreno. The cross is on. Ibora, Alcacer, 
tremendous challenge. Johan Jordan. Suso has it. Moving the ball forward with purpose. Just couldn't capitalise there. And there to intervene. Kunde. Here's Fernando. Ronnie Lopez. There's a slide draw pass. Really vital interception here. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Capu. Well, that pass easy on the eye. Well, flinging himself at it. Well, opting for the short corner. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. Well, it came to nothing in the end. And taking it away. Moy Gomez. Alcacer well, making high pressing work for them here he made it look simple really could be a chance to break here well these fans are pushing their team on here they sense a winner's coming the defender put in the challenge and it might be a red card and in the refereeing trade, they call it Dogzo, denial of a goal-scoring opportunity. Well, the referee's got that right. He saved a possible goal there, but at a cost. And that is a free-kick artist at work. What a goal it was. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? And into the last 15 minutes of action. Careless in possession. Suso. And now Lopez. And there it is. A penalty given and a chance perhaps for them to finish this off. And this could really make certain. And in it goes. As calmly as you like. Never in any doubt from the spot. Second goal for them here. Well read to ease the pressure. Suso. Really showing off his wide range of passing skills. Lucas Ocampos. And still dangerous. And a time for composure on the ball. Applying vigorous pressure. A really sumptuous ball. Oh, the referee points to the spot. Penalty. To finish it as a contest. In it goes. Coley converts it. This is looking rather comfortable for them. 3-0. See some progress with the ball at his feet. Well, they're going to be very cross with themselves because that was a wasted opportunity. And that will be all for this game anyway. And...
from the Spanish top flight, La Liga. It's Atletico Madrid taking on Sevilla. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, 
outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. Johan Jordan, and good work from Atletico to win the ball back. And here are the starters for Atletico. Jan Oblak stands between oh, the can posts. Can he finish it here, Derek? And the ball is loose. And he clears it out of harm's way. Well, they've started the game really brightly here, and they've looked dangerous. But that was a top-class save from the keeper. Brilliant from him. You can probably see why we're focusing on this fellow as one to watch. Stewart, in particular, what do you expect to see from him? Well, Derek, we know he loves linking up with other players, but it's when he's in and around the penalty area, that's when he's at his most dangerous, when he plays little one-twos around his marker and then plays the next forward pass into a runner. He... Oh, it's developing nicely for them here. Well, I must say, that goes down as a very disappointing effort. Suarez. Fine teamwork to win it back. Johan Jordan. He could pick out a teammate. Far from a good pass. Ronnie Lopez. Oh, blocked it! Given away by Atletico. Looking confident with the ball at his feet. Oh, great defending. Really good interception. Luis Suarez. Good vision, can he get onto this? And he's in. And there it is, the opening goal. 1-0, and they'll feel they deserve it. So on they go again. Let's find out if Atletico can square the match. A bit of running room now on the wing. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Lamar. Wonderful challenge and a throw in coming up. Felix. This could level it. And it is the equaliser. Parity now. And who's to say what's going to happen next? Back underway. Level pegging. One goal apiece in this game. Very quick thinking there. there intended for Suso it has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw in a good effective pressure high up the pitch and that is how to beat your opponent not problematic for the keeper and he takes it away Johan Jordan Youssef N. Naziri. Ronnie Lopez. Now, what can they do from here? Teammate and support. Well, able to close down the short. The first half here comes to an end. Underway then in the second half. And the two teams matching each other just about stride for stride. Not totally confused as opponent. Well, in the final analysis, it was good defending. Oh. 
Suarez. Joao Felix. It's gone in! And well, he might celebrate on the back of that. Well, as they kick off again, 2-1 the current state of affairs. Thomas Lemar. Not really the ideal clearance. And problem solved for now. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Well, it looked highly promising, but it came to nothing in the end. Well, as you can see, Atletico are seeing much less of the ball, but their counter-attacking has been really good, particularly in the wide areas. It's been an excellent performance from them so far. Now we're into the final half hour. He's given it straight to the opposition. Fernando Lopez and the emphasis is on creativity big chance to get them on terms crucial intervention just then amid impending danger Koke on to Suarez Carrasco will he play it in Showing patience as well as persistence in the build-up. And the danger's still on. Well, they can keep possession of it now. Dangerous looking through ball. Well, I think you could call that an escape. It looked a certain goal. Joao Felix. Good work to regain possession. Attack looks promising. Lucas Ocampos. Jimenez. Joao Felix. Really nice ball. And intercepted it. Felix, well he's thwarted him almost effortlessly Suarez and a very good challenge and the counter looks on here options available oh in with a chance surely what late excitement and the match is level well back underway here and they've split the four goals between them so far Joao Felix oh that's a super ball over the top he might be able to make it through oh can you believe it with so little time left surely that will be the winner amazing scenes here well, the game has been restarted 3-2 here and there is going to be stoppage time but only the one minute and forward they go chasing the game well nothing comes of it it looked promising and the referee blows his whistle for four times. Open eye, feel the waves cut through me, hypnotized by the sounds I'm breathing in. Hold tight, hold tight, chemicals collide. Hold tight, hold tight.
Patrick Gantry and delighted to be joined as always by Stuart Robson. An action coming up from the Spanish top division, La Liga. It's Atletico Madrid and they face Villarreal. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. And this is the starting lineup for Atletico. Jan Oblak is the preferred keeper. Jose Maria Jimenez plays with Stefan Savic in central defence. Rodrigo Javier de Pau starts alongside Koke in central midfield. And the tactical configuration has two players in attack from the very outset. De Powell. Koke. And he's won the ball. How can they create something? And not cleared away properly. Well, threat over for now. Well, what a chance that was to take the lead. But you have to give the goalkeeper credit. What a brilliant save that was. And the assistant referee has raised his flag. Offside. And it wasn't a great pass, was it? And you don't want to lose possession there. And the last touch off the defender. So a corner coming up. Well, he failed to get it away properly. Now well, the keeper wanted to take it cleanly and did. Alcázar. Tremendous challenge. Lamar. Oh, he's really opened them up here and running in behind. And goalkeeping of the highest order from Sergio Asenjo. Gerard Moreno. Moreno in with a chance. Jan Oblak, fantastic between the posts. Taken short. Teammates in the middle. Might still be able to do a bit of damage. And the keeper was finally able to claim it. Well, what a great piece of goalkeeping. Firstly the save, and then the recovery. Brilliant from him. Joao Felix. Giving the ball away. Etienne Capou. Gaspar, ball with Ibora. Alert defending, not problematic for the keeper. Joao Felix. It's a good looking Atletico move in the making. And let's give credit to the defending. Moreno. Atletico had it back. Carrasco. Crossing possibilities. Now well, the managers will now deliver their heart. As anticipated, plenty of talking points so far. And now the second half is underway. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Gerard Moreno. And looking towards the back post. Well, in fact, a good but straightforward claim by the keeper. 
Breaking at pace. But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. Ibora. And here's Gerard Moreno. Alcacer. Capu. And he takes it on. Oh, marvellous save. Great goalkeeping. Well, they're going for the short one. Firing it towards goal. Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. Well, those stats really do tell you everything. So many chances, but yet so little end product. At some point, though, you sense they're going to get the breakthrough. Forward they go, using Carrasco on this occasion. Joao Felix, really getting stuck in. And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. Not a great pass. De Powell. Koke with it. Atletico have given it away. Moreno. Now De Paul. A lot of momentum to this Atletico attack. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Suarez. Well, a badly timed run, just a fraction offside. Tukweze. Capu. That's a useful cross. Well, the danger is still there. Lamar. 15 minutes left for play. Oh, breezing past him. Good pressure. Can they make something of this? Goalkeeper's ball every day of the week. Okay, careless with the pass. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Can he put them in front? He does! And with so little time left, that might be the winner. Wonderful drama. Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. Joao Felix. We might very well have late excitement here. Five minutes to go, and just one goal between them. That's how to dispossess your opponent. Chukweze. Capu. Counter-attacking, very much an option. Will it be sufficiently imaginative? And not a great cross, making the goalkeeper's job rather easy. And that is that. The referee blows his whistle for... The gravity pulls you straight down feathers and see this too when you want to get off the darkest ground the gravity pulls you straight
to get off that darkest ground But gravity pulls you straight down Earth from a bird's eye view You should grow feathers and see this too forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible hopefully we get a really good game here the Sevilla side as follows Yassine Bounou is the goalkeeper Jesus Navas plays with Marcos Acuna in the wide defensive areas Lucas Ocampos plays with Suso in the wide positions and the tactical configuration has two players in attack oh, can he finish it Derek Still danger here, and there it is, an almost intuitive 
ways of finishing. So underway again here, 1-0 the score. He made it look simple, really. Ocampos. On to Jordan. A spot on with that challenge. Opportunity in the wide area. This could square the game. And that's exactly what has transpired. Now, that could be a massive turning point. And momentum is with them. So underway again here on the back of that leveller. Can they forge ahead? He's foiled them on his own. Ibora. Alcata. And he saw the situation developing. Johan Jordan. Fernando. And a fine tackle. I must say, this looks promising. Now, well, nothing comes of it. Johan Jordan. Here's Fernando. A really sumptuous ball. And just narrowly wide in the end. Moreno showing a real will to win the ball. But what can they do to stop him running at them? Youssef and Naziri. Oh, he's given us away inexplicably. Oh, a moment of pure class! Unbridled joy for him and the supporters! So the ball is rolling again. 2-1 the scoreline. Well timed tackle. Suso. Here's Fernando. Youssef and Naziri. Fernando. Moving the ball effectively, looking for the right moment. Oh, could have given them an even healthier advantage. Well, it's a good effort to extend their lead, but the game's still in the balance here. Etienne Capou. He's given us away. Well, half-time coming up shortly, and the home oh, Derek, side on top. What a great opportunity. Majestic piece of goalkeeping. Well, he loves the big moments, doesn't he? And he's proved it again there. Great goalkeeping. And a short corner, let's see. And he's taken us away. And room now out on the wing. A chance for him to get in behind, maybe. And the keeper throws himself up the ball. And played short. Well, the managers will now deliver their... The second half is underway here. Sevilla with the lead. Committed challenge. That was a move of great promise. They could easily have been in. Well, the attack finally comes to nothing, and the keeper has it. Ronnie Lopez off the post and back in play. Well, had that gone in, the game was firmly in their hands. Now, though, they've got to make sure they don't let this slip. Really important piece of last-ditch defending. 
You certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Stuart. Yeah, he's had a good first half, hasn't he? Looked lively, created plenty of chances and rewarded for his industry with that key goal. Hopefully he can keep that momentum going into the second half now. Chukwese. Kapu now. Could be a chance to break here. Oh, maybe the equaliser. A goal! Real excitement. A back and forth type of game. Now they're level. Well, back underway here. And they've split the four goals between them so far. going to end up being productive for them but they took care of the situation defensively Ronnie Lopez might take the lead oh a powerful effort close Alcázar and in with a real chance and he scored not once but twice they simply cannot stop him, and no wonder he's enjoying himself. Underway again, and we're being treated to plenty of goals. 3-2 at the moment. 20 minutes to go. Well, as you can see, Villarreal haven't enjoyed the majority of possession, but when they have had it, they've looked so dangerous, particularly when they press high up the field, win the ball back in those areas, and then counter-attack quickly. Ibora, Alcacer, and no way through. Johan Jordan, Suso, crucial interception amid impending danger. Chukwese. it the denial of a clear goal scoring opportunity if so he's off and the referee didn't have much choice ascending off it is yeah no oh and taken cleanly by the goalkeeper Ibora not to be advised giving the ball away there and hunting for his second goal tonight, however. Well, you're absolutely right. He's been on great form today. That was another good effort. A struggle to get it away properly. This could square the game. The importance of that tackle cannot be overstated. But a crucial intervention inside the box. Moreno. Now can they create something? Well, the ball can be the goalkeeper's best friend well the players should be inspired by this the crowd have really got behind them today and the referee blows his whistle for full time
partner, Stuart Robson. And if this game lives up to its billing, we're in for a riveting occasion. It is Victoria Pilsen, and they face Sparta Pride. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It's... And he's through here. And offside by a very small margin. Great reflex action. Well, that should have been a goal. Mind you, it's a brilliant save. Delivering it. Oh, surely. A truly magnificent start. An early goal in the game. Just what they were hoping to produce. Well, the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? Jean-David Bouguen. A good and fair challenge. Couldn't keep it. Good movement. Well, no luck keeping possession. And he read it well. And giving the ball away. Oh, moving it nicely. A very effective challenge put in. Well, let's see if something comes of this. And the keeper did magnificently. Well, that's just a wonderful save. How did he stop that? Dutch Cal. They look as though they want to make this move count. Can he play it in? Well, not the greatest pass. Easily intercepted. And they know they need to stop him. And a really powerful effort, but just over the top. Nicely timed tackle. Not to be advised giving the ball away there. It's a weighted pass. There it is. Two to the good now. And that gives them a buffer. So 2-0 now. Jean-David Bouguen. Options in the centre. Working away patiently, looking for an opening. And tremendous individual skill. Possession changes hands, the interception there. A move of promise on the flank. And showing fine vision. Just unable to take advantage of that developing situation. Rob them. And that's very good refereeing to let the play flow. Alesh Chermak. Now well, the manager... Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Carlson and a fine tackle. Kalbach. And it's with Chermak. 
Poor pass. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Carlson. Well, that's how to break the spirit of the attacker. They've given it away. Is this the moment? Oh, excellent diving stop. Who can he pick out? And a goal kick is the outcome. Well, as you can see, the hosts have had most of the ball, but most of their passing has been in deeper areas. Unless they start getting it into their front players with better quality, they'll struggle to turn this one around. So, a half an hour remaining. Borzek Dochkal. Well, he's lost it. Lukas Kalbach. Moving into the advanced position. Now, will they be able to play it in behind the defence? Well, showing excellent judgment to intercept. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. He's got the right idea with that pass. But a crucial intervention inside the box. Now, this could really lift spirits. Oh, incredible save, and he snuffed out the danger. Well, what can they do to stop him running at them? Carlson. Beautifully weighted ball. Nothing comes of the attack when all is said and done. Milan Havel. Jean-David Boguel. Lukas Kalbach. Boguel has it. Could be. Goalkeeper getting in the way. Superb save. Well, this has to be their way back into the game. The crowd are certainly playing their part. Jean-David Boguel. Good tackle. Really bright-looking attack. And cleared away. Showing a real desire to win it back. Pavelka. And he read it well, intercepting it. Well, just one minute of time added on for stoppages here. Now just the tackle that was needed. And that will be a corner. Favouring the short one. And that is the end of the game. It goes into the history.